I just wanted to take a few minutes and just pause the build and explain the concept of what I'm working on here. Um, this is a gift from my wife who has a beautiful singing voice. Um, and she uses that gift to serve at our local church, singing on the worship team. And so I wanted to give her something that was kind of reflective of that, and just kind of a statement of her faith as well. So we've had this box of old hymnals that we picked up years ago, knowing that we were going to use them for some kind of crafting purposes. Um, and I tore one apart. I hope this isn't going to get me in trouble with anybody, um, but it's for a good purpose. But the idea is I'm gonna take these and I'm just gonna kind of have them strewn all about this whole board. Um, and then I'm gonna Mod Podge everything down. The the letters here will get painted and then glued down on top of the board and then the entire thing will get framed up. And I've run a test with some Mod Podge here just to make sure that they'll stick and it looks like this is going to be perfect. So now that I've got all that out of the way, let's get back to the build. So it's the next morning. I came back out to the shop to check on the board and I really hate it. <laughs> I, it's just awful. Um, let me show you what my problem is and then I'll kind of talk through, I think, how I'm gonna try to fix it. What I don't like about it is the inconsistency in colors. You have a lot of spots like here that are very yellow compared to over here or like splotchy colors over here. Um, and, and that's probably just my application of the Mod Podge whatever. It could be that it's bad. It could be that I'm an idiot and I don't know how to use it. That's fine. Either way. I just, I'm not satisfied with how this looks. That being said, all that it has cost me is a piece of MDF and a little bit of work tearing out hem pages. Um, I have more. I'm going to take another book and I've got a stack still left over. Um, so today I'm going to get to work pulling out some more hems. And I think what I'm going to do is try some spray adhesive um, instead of the Mod Podge and see if we can't get a better result. father built their house from the ground up and this is leftover stock that was not used in the flooring the rest of their house is floored with this very same pecan um, and I'm thinking this is this is kind of preliminary but I'm thinking I may not even take out these grooves um, from the underside of it just to sort of give an idea of where it came from uh, once the project is done So I just realized that I did all of this without hitting record, um, but I went ahead and put the frame together. Um, so it's all the way done all the way around. Uh, and then I dropped this guy into the frame where I had cut the rabbits in previously. And then I just ran some brad nails uh, every so many inches to hold it in. So there it is, all done. This thing turned out great. Wow. <laughs> oh wow. It's something to hang on the wall. That is so 